Hi everyone, and welcome to LiveX's Rivet How-To Series. Today we're going to take a look at how Rivet can interact with vMix, and vMix is a really great SRT tool, well, so let's take a look at how vMix and Rivet can make some magic. So here we are in vMix, and I've got my program feed running, I have just a YouTube video playing. So I'm going to create an SRT input. So from here, we're going to choose stream type SRT listener. I already have a preset for what I'm going to use now. So uh, just make sure you have a forwarded port ready to go. From here, you can set your latency. I'm gonna stay at 200 for now. And then you could also add a delay if you want, but I'm just gonna keep it the way it is for right now. So there it is, the black box SRT will be our rivet friend come. So I'll click the cogwheel, and from here I'll go to my outputs, NDISRT, and click the cogwheel on output four. I use normally use output one for records or something else. So from here, I wanna make sure my audio channel is audio uh, bus A, because we're gonna do some mix minus stuff with rivet, and we don't want our guests to hear themselves back. We're gonna enable SRT, a listener, and configure uh, have a configured port. So after this, what I wanna do is create an IFB back channel. So I, if I wanted to talk to the guest, but I didn't want it to go into program. So I'm gonna add another input. And on, here at LiveX, we have a Dante network. So I'm gonna use Dante RX1, click okay. And I'm just gonna make sure I'm not on master. I obviously don't want this to go out into my program. And then I'm gonna select a bus that no one else is on. So I'm gonna use bus B so I can talk to my guest uh, without having that kind of issue. So we're all set up and we're ready for our rivet friend to come in. Oh, there's our rivet guest and it's me. <laughs> Welcome. So here we are. Rivet in vMix.